Good morning. Let's see, am I recording? I think so, I don't see numbers, but I think I'm recording. Yes. So I just wanted to quickly show you how I get her breakfast ready on a Friday, because on Friday I do two supplements. Well, I always do the probiotic with enzymes, but I also do D-mannose, which I'll talk about in a second. So here's my pre-measured half a cup breakfast, which is the egg casserole. Okay, so I'm gonna put it in here and I break it up. And I'm gonna add a teeny tiny bit of water to make like a gravy. And I'm gonna microwave this for 24 seconds. And well, that's microwaving. So I do this every day in the morning. It's a probiotic with enzymes. It has to be kept in the refrigerator. You cannot put it in the food, you know, to cook the food or like I have my food in the microwave. If you do that, it'll kill the probiotic. Um, enzymes are needed for dogs so they can break down food. And of course, probiotic is good for gut health. And then we have D mannose. This I use as a preventive measure for UTIs. Bella, who's 10 years old, knock on wood, let me get some wood here, uh, has never had a UTI. Um, but I use this as a preventive measure once a week, like an eighth of a teaspoon. If your dog has a UTI, of course you should go to your vet. But in addition to taking the medicine, I would be giving this uh, in conjunction with the medicine for like four days. And then after the dog um, is done with the UTI, I give this once a week as a preventive me measure. Okay, let me get the food out of the microwave. Hey, I'm not a vet, but my other dog, rest in peace, no, he had one or two UTIs. <clears throat> as he was getting older. And I talked to my vet about doing D-mannose and she was okay with it. So anyway, here's my food. <clears throat> Can you see that? And I'm gonna make sure that it's all broken up. I put my finger in it because I don't want it to be hot. Okay, there's a gonzo bean that wasn't mixed up. And I have the probiotic. Again, you cannot put this in food and then cook it and it has to be stored in the refrigerator. I get it on Amazon. And I have an eighth of a teaspoon. Where do I get that? Well, I used to sell Pampered Chef many years ago, and they have an eighth of a teaspoon. Um, and I put that in here. The directions are all on the back. Like for me, it says dogs. A quarter of a teaspoon for each 30 pounds of the dog's body weight. So Bella, is around 12 pounds. So I give her an eighth of a teaspoon. You can also give this to cats. So I put that in. Now with this D-Nanos, I'm annoyed by it. It comes with one of those little things on the inside, I guess, to keep it fresh, but it clumps up. I've actually put this through a pill crusher <laughs> to uncrush it, but it's, it's annoying. Um, so there's an eighth of a teaspoon. I put that in. And then I'm just gonna stir it around to evenly distribute it. On Fridays, I always give the D-manos, and every morning, I always give the probiotic. And for some reason, I'm not here in the morning if my husband has to feed her or feeds her on the weekends. I don't have him do it. I just do it at night because I like to be in control of you know, what she gets. Call me a control freak or call me whatever you want. Anyway, that's it. Thank you very much. And I'm going to give this to Bella right now and start my day.